Smaller arm. Prepare to meet Kali in hell. Welcome back, everybody. The next honorable mention in the ICG Break Shit Community Contest. Today we're out here with the Zed Garot, brought to us by the one, the only Kaiser Avatar. He, he's he's literally the the only Kaiser Avatar on our server. So that, that's that's accurate. This base is a kind of a combination of a few of the things we've done in season three. You can see there's some colored steps and there's some spikes and the Zeds are going to bounce up the steps. They're going to land in the spikes and they're going to get shot in the face. And down here, there's nowhere for them to really go. This is just going to be a bad scene. So I'm curious to see how well the pathing here works, especially you got the little quarter block ledge here. So the concept here is pretty straightforward. There's no real huge tricks here, I think, just looking at the, you know, the expected pathing. If there are any surprises, obviously I'll eat my words. For starters, I think we're in good shape. Kaiser has been kind enough not only to wire this up, but also give us a little supply room. You can see from the supply room here, we've got shotgun shells and gasoline, and then everybody gets their own box of supplies, even though some people seem to think that they don't have a box of supplies with their name on it, but clearly, Everyone has a box of supplies with their oh. name on it. I'll, uh, I'll give you a hint. It's between Davian and I. No, it's not. We can fix this real quick. I mean, they seem to all be catered directly towards us. So let's just see what's in the box and then we'd know if it's Okay, dead. sure. Oh, yeah, so yeah. so my box has ammo and medical supplies and red tea and food. And Davian's box is very similar. Some shotgun shells and some 7.62. And Xavier's box is... Also, again, pretty much the same thing. Ammo and shotgun shells and concrete and a hammer and we're doing good. Duels is uh -huh. a lot of beer and steroids. This is clearly Duels box. I think no one would argue that that's Duels box. So the last box that certainly hasn't been claimed by anyone, we open that up and we see ammo and shotgun shells. And what's this? A furry suit? A dyed furry mine. suit? I, I, f I feel like that pretty much sews that one up. Oh, shit. <laughs> and I'm I mean, pretty sure in our Discord, I have told Kaiser he is dead to me. Santa granted my wish. X put, is putting clothes on. Um, I don't know if this counts as what's what's happening here. We this do not enough? have two. What the? F I'm so weirded out right now and strangely turned on. I can tell. Why is it red? He just looks like a Muppet. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> He's like some sort of Chechen <laughs> knockoff <laughs> Elmo. <laughs> like, is, is this the uh, is this a season six uh, Stranger Things villain? Elmo it's the a... big word. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Elmo. Taking a look at the cost scores, we're all in the ballpark here. No major surprises regarding costs. I came in at a six, Nev's at a five, Davian at a seven, Duel at a six, and X at a six. Now, for me at the six, and all the rest of us having six, I think this is a. Oh, fairly whoa, 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 straightforward. Up, nope, nope. What? I'm, I'm busy. This is a fairly straightforward build. There's not a whole lot going on here on the surface. You know, it's it is what meets the eye. The reason I'm taking this down from probably a seven isn't so much the turrets or the steel and the hatches or anything like that. But if you take a peek underground, you can see now intelligently his escape hatch and his whole plinth here are pretty substantial. He paved the entire thing going that way, and then he paved the whole tube going back up down the road. So that is adding to the cost here, I think. So I feel like a six is pretty well justified. I don't think five is necessarily bad. It's just, it's an average amount of concrete. Now, granted, that's average as considered by Akiva and probably Davian, and it's minuscule compared to X and myself, but yeah, everything yes. you've ever built. This is your front stoop. You build bases like Calvin and build snowmen. No, oh, this is just his toe. Like, yeah, okay. <laughs> Stop touching me, Elmo, over here. What the fuck? <laughs> Do you want to have Elmo inside you? I think for pathing, we are supposed to do this from down inside the pillbox. Yep, so they think they can come up to us. That, that make would sense. make sense. Not all the way down, Chuckles. I know, I'm turning the generator on. Oh, that would help. What's the upper level for? Repairs and the turrets, I guess? Or maybe we're not all supposed yeah. to be here? Let's start so here, my, and then we'll split it up. best judgment, then. Someone else's best judgment. All right, let's let him path. Hold on, don't let him up quite yet. Let's let him path. I kind of want to see what happens is when they get to the top. He's got all this black ramp feature built in and everything, so let's see how they behave on it. They runs walk. over here. She punches. She spiders. Okay. The sp 
spidering that occurs these days, I think they are going to try to climb in here pretty aggressively. Uh -oh. That also means that you can make it melee oriented. It can. What happens if we go up top? Maybe not up oh, top, but to the second floor. I think we have to have oh. some people down here because they're just going to climb in here. Yeah, that's probably true. And then if you come out here, this is kind of hard to get to. Uh, yeah, I think the best we could do is if we had people out here, like on the black ramp looking in, but we can't see the inner circle of it. Is he thinking duel? Duel? Mm -hmm. Yeah, me? Begin fisting. Outside or inside? I inside here. What if you fist somebody, uh, one of these guys off this catwalk here and into the spikes? Okay. Mm. I was built for this. This is the moment duels train for all those minutes. Fist. 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 Ah! Apparently, mo we cannot have multiple fisting. I got fist! Fist! Faster. I understand now why they don't like it. <laughs> is that what I've been doing <laughs> to people? We're so inhumane. Are we the baddies? All right, let's go zombies. Let's get these fools. I mean, this is actually kind of working right up until I get lit on fire. I don't know if the Zed Grot was built as an all fister base, but that's how we're going to do it for now. Fister. Fister. Oh, no. Stop touching me, Elmo. You want to touch <laughs> this, them, Elmo. This season newest toy, the Fister Me Elmo. Have you ever been tickled on the inside? Where's this uh, special escape hole? Uh, ask Elmo. You wait until they come around the ledge and then you hit them into the spikes. That's been the, uh, the MO so far. It's, uh, not exactly foolproof. Oh, uh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, Stop something touching tells me. me we're not playing this as intended. I don't think he's gonna appreciate the way we decided to run this one. I might be breaking the base by going down the escape hatch, but that's what's gonna happen. Poor Kaiser has to watch us turn his base into Fistropolis. It's working I'm though, isn't more it? Fun this way. It, it, I right? mean, I think it's a testament to the design that we went full time fisting and somehow it actually still works. Why am I on fire? Because you walked into the fire. Why am I fisted? Because you walked into the fist. Stop fire. touching me, Elmo! Elmo loves the way you smell. <laughs> Oh, Do you want to watch Elmo go potty? Should we rename it? Because we are going to get a letter from Sesame Street. Mostly we're ripping off South Park right now, so it's fine. We're going to get two letters. I'll frame that shit. Let me get a cease and desist from Sesame Street. I will fucking bronze that thing. <laughs> right? I want one of those. Can you pay for Same. it? That'll be the new cover image on our channel. <laughs> Is it designed for this? It's designed for crouching and shooting. Oh, that may actually be the thing. I don't know. Oh. If you crouch while you're in this corner, you get so much better view than if you were just standing. No, in the he's corner. got. Look, he put a fister up on this block here. Let's see what happens here. Well, I think you can do it, but yeah, I think it works for both. Oh, whoa, 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 Karen, come on. Well, they're getting fistered. I figured it out. I think you did. Good thing there's five of us. Then I can be the freelance fister. I'm not a professional fister, though. You're not a professional fister, but you did stay at a Holiday Inn Express last night. <laughs> Hank got fisted. With me? I stayed at a Holiday Inn Express when I was on my way up to Nev's wedding, and it was the shittiest hotel I've ever seen. Sure, it ain't one of them la -dee da above ground places, but if you like Dank, forget about it. The ones around here are really good. The ones around here are really good too, but I stopped outside of Boston at a fucking Holiday Inn thinking, okay, this should be fine, and it was bad. I have stayed at hotels with motor in the name that were better. I told you about my chicken nugget hotel, right? What? <laughs> Driving back in a box truck from um, Iowa City. It was really bad, like it was like a blizzard. After an hour, I, you know, I couldn't drive faster than 30 miles an hour. So I was going real slow, and then uh, a big gust of wind go comes and, you know, puts me sideways on the interstate. I'm like, yeah, I'm not driving anymore. You know, first hotel was inside. I pulled up to and just went to go get a room, and I went to the room, and I opened up the mini bar, or the, the mini fridge, and there's just a box of chicken McNuggets in the fridge. I mean, that's free Waiting McNuggets. For me. Or it's, yeah. mi or it's <laughs> mini bar McNuggets and they're like eight bucks a piece. <laughs> Wait, when we stayed in the Outer Banks, wasn't there like a pair of underwear under your bed or something? Yes. Yes, there was. <laughs> Duel Forgot has good that. luck with rooms. <laughs> Forgot about that. <laughs> when we went to uh, Gatlinburg, we stayed at uh, one of those hotels with the motor in the name of it. Opened up the mini fridge and found a single slice of salami. Nice. Yes, salami. I stayed at a uh, Best Western out in uh, Western New York once a long, long time ago. And I went up and I paid for the room and they did their shtick and they gave me the car key card and I went up to the room and I opened the door and I was greeted by the Asian tourist family that was already in that room. <laughs> that was a little weird. Uh-oh. Oh. oh. Oh, what is setting them off? I can't do anything about this with full-time fisting. What are they beating on? Oh, Davian. 
Let's take a walk outside here. So Davian's <laughs> getting wailed on. The spikes are getting banged up. There's some damage there. Happened behind me. There's the it's pavement is a little yeah, screwed I went up. To, he gave us some concrete, so I want to fix up some of the steps. We're, we're doing all right up here, though. The base is getting a little banged up because uh, those demos got set off. But other than that, we're we're in decent shape. I think fisting. I'm still fisting full time. I, I don't even care. Like I'm, this is how I'm playing this base. The base is basically turning us into a podcast. Which I mean says a good thing about the base. It's another one where you don't really have to think about it. We're just shooting and fisting, shooting and fisting. It's like every other night of the week for us. Well, even though we're not recording. We need a podcast. Oh God. <laughs> no. ICG says shit. <laughs> That might be worth I something. Mean. So there we go. We have the name. We're already halfway there. Uh, branding's done. I'm going on break. All mm -hmm. right, boys and girls. It's time for our mumptions minute. <laughs> Just Nev grunting at us. I'm not mumptions. <laughs> and that was the mumptions minute. <laughs> Clint. Plinth talk. Plinth. Plinth. You can't threaten us with plinth anymore. We added plinth discord, or like emojis to discord. Like clearly we've embraced this. The plinth occupies a spot akin to the flying tree. I mean, the craziest thing about it is the fact that we have lore. I know. How the fuck do we have lore? This is a You're channel welcome. About, like us making <laughs> dick jokes and Nev's a furry named Mumptions and I just I fucking somehow there's just it has lore. How the fuck does this have lore? Ooh, Elmo likey. Uh, <laughs> Can the man who plays Elmo get your Instagram? All right, Mumpson, just two hours left. Put on the suit. Who gave Elmo an M4? And I just gone fairly quickly. I really have been just passing the time fisting. It's an honest day's work. I'm going to need to do some, like, Kegel exercises after this. So, ah, why am I on fire? Are we done? I think we just wrapped the night. At Holy 2 shit. 2.30. Cause fisting makes me feel good. Makes me Aww, feel good they too. Blew up my fister. My fister's not even at half fucking durability. God, fisting. Just didn't save the day. All right, spikes. All right, pavements beat to shit. Stairs got banged up. Spikes got banged up. This side did pretty well. They didn't really come over to this side a lot. That guy's down there, all chewed up. These spikes got a little banged up. So in general, this held up pretty well. The parts that we're gonna, you know, got shit on are the parts you would expect to get shit on. Overall, I think this uh, this held up pretty well. The turrets were clearly handling the bird traffic because God knows we have been getting swamped by birds lately and we really didn't have much of any. I think I killed one myself all night long. A round of applause for Kaiser Avatar. Nice base. And there was much rejoicing. Taking a look at the safety score, this one did pretty well. Nev, Davian, and I all came in at eights for safety, dual and X at sevens, which is pretty solid scoring. I think there were some instances now with the spidering and the crouching behavior where they tried to cram their way into here. But in general, <laughs> if you can deal with the, you know, the occasional fat man in a Hawaiian shirt trying to cram his way in, you're going to do all right. And this held up pretty well, and there, there weren't any major safety snafus here. Now, the fun score, I think this might be the first time we've all scored unanimously eights across the board that's not a bad uh showing this one shared some similarities i think in style with the philosophical fortress last week was it a a barn burner the most active or engaging thing we've ever played no i was fisting the whole time and if you've watched any of our videos you realize that's basically never happened so there's something to be said for that but we were essentially just kind of standing around shooting the shit it was engaging enough that we weren't bored but it was secure enough that we didn't have to be white knuckling it the entire time and it held up really well i think this was a, a an enjoyable base to run i thought tonight went really quickly and that's always a testament of a good design looking at the final score for the zed garot a 108 a very respectable showing definitely a a, uh, a worthwhile contender, as it were, is coming up an up and comer. Uh, Davian is actively jacking it in this hatch. Actively jacking it. Okay. Stick around. Coming up next, we've got shoots and ladders from 13. He's got a lot of poles. He's got ladders. He's got Zeds climbing up ladders. He's got sniper rifle plans. He's got dart traps. I think it's going to be a gory one. No lie. I think there's going to be a body count here. Maybe we'll see a little bit more of Stop Touching Me Elmo. 13 did say to use, uh... The penetrator perk. How you doing? Erecting to the right. All right. I can see it. Penetrator. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's in fucking Narnia 4K way, I'm sure. I am not. You're a, you're literally, on. we're still recording. I hear you coming back to your microphone. You just straight up <laughs> fucking left. <laughs> Like, you all right, we're, anything. we're gonna record the outro. X is in his backyard having a smoke. Oh, what? Am I supposed to be somewhere? Stick around. You're definitely gonna want to see shoots and ladders in action. As always, we appreciate you watching, and we will catch you next time. 
<laughs> Probably thought we were going to do the bussy next. 